seek for it tugiye kuja mu mwanya wo gusoma ijambo ry'Imana kuko dufite uruhimbi we are going into the word of the lord for we have the holy communion mbere yuko dusoma ijambo ry'Imana but before we read the word mu byukuri ndabashimiye kuko mwanyakiriye neza i want to thank you for you will come me well wa kabiri twabanye nababashe kuboneka on Tuesday we are with people that came for fellowship no gatatu even on Wednesday no kane on Thursday again no kuwa gatanu kuko twadi dufite amateraniro iminsi yose even on Friday we had fellowship narimba kumbuye i missed you kandi mu byukuri ndabirata mu buzima bwanje bwose and you are my pride all my life abakomeje guhagarara mu cuho mukakora murimo w'Imana mu buryo butandukanye people that stood in the gap to do the work of the ministry in different ways hari Imana ifite ingororano kandi izagororera buri wese bihwanye nibyo yakoze god will reward you according to the works of your hands mwarakoze cyane ndabashimiye i thank you Thank you so much. Ndagira ngo nshime Imana kuko kutumwera nkanone gizimpanuka ida idasanzwe ari ku Imana. Had an accident and the Lord protected him. Hari sa 11 wenda ni minota nka 33 gutya. It was around 5:30. Ndanyerera muri Benyuare. Benyuare murayibona ikimeze nk'umuvure. And he slid. Ndanyerera kugira ngo niramire inkweto imvaho taka isirasimbuka iva muri benyuare nanje ndarwana mu kurwana mva muri benyuare nza kugwa hirya ya benyuare nza kugwa kuri siege ya ya toilette i slid and uh, for him protect himself uh, the shoes got off but uh, he fell near the toilet somewhere tumba cyari gikinze nari nje nyine nta wari no kumenya kuko napfuye kuko urabyumva nuko niko bimeze he was alone in the room nobody would have known that he is gone muri kwa kurwana maraika yandwanira imbavu zaravunaguritse ofete ndizavunitse ariko narababaye cyane in that struggle the angels were protecting him but he got hurt mu byukuri ndasanaho navuye mu rupfu it is like he escaped death umwanzi buri gihe abadukira icobo ari ku witeka kadukira kanzu ko kuva mu cobo every now and then the devil is digging a holes for us but the lord always rescues us muri iminsi nagiza amahirwe ya buri gitondo kwatura za buri ya 2023 every day during these days i've been declaring psalms 23 iyo nta yatuye mu gitondo ngenda ahantu numva ari nkaho nk'umuntu wamenyereye it is his daily thing for him to declare Psalms 23. We all know the Psalm, the Lord is my shepherd. Shall you clap for the Lord for he did well to me? Nanone Turi Hanganisha muzi kuko turi muri bibihe iminsi ijana yo kwibuka abavandimwe bacitse kwicumu we stand with they that uh, genocide survivors in the 100 days of remembrance dukomeje kubihanganisha mukomere muri Kristo Yesu please be strong in Christ Jesus Yesu yataza kuzuka mu bapfuye ntacho twari kubabwira if Jesus had not resurrected from the dead would not tell you anything ariko dufite ibyiringiro kuko abadusize bizeye tuzabasanga kandi tuzabana nabo ubuziraherezo but we have hope to see the people who died when they had believed rero bene data ta mwihangane kandi imana niyo ifite ubushobozi bwo kubihanganisha be strong and we pray the lord will strengthen you tugiye gusoma ijambo ry'imana kugira ngo tuje kuruhimbi we are going to the word of the lord before the holy communion ndaza gusaba abakozi b'imana abapastori nabandi bari bufatikanye muhaguruke tuje hariya 
kumeza noneho dusome ijambo ry'Imana dubite twinjira mu gikorwa nyirizina kugira ngo tuze kubona umwanya wo kuganira ijambo ry'Imana We request the pastors and the people that helped to go stand by the table so that we may get ample time to do the rest Reka mbasabe abashumba Let me request the pastors mwakwegera hariya Shall you please come towards the table Noneho dusome ijambo ry'Imana We read the word of the Lord Kandi abari bwegera uruhimbi nabantu babatijwe the people that will do holy communion are the people that were baptized niyo discipline yitorero ry'Imana that is the church doctrine dusome muri ruka let's go to the gospel of luke ibice 22 na 12 wa 14 chapter 22 and verse 14 Makumyabiri na kabiri ibice makumyabiri na bibiri umurongo wa 14 Luke 22 and verse 14 Ijambo ry'Imana ryavuga ngo igihe gisohoye ari icarango afungure kandi intumwa nazo zicarana nawe arazibwira ati kwifuza nifuje gusangira namwe pasika pasiki ntarababazwa ndababwira yuko ntazongera rwose kurya kuyirira kugezaho izasohorera mu bwami bw'Imana yenda igikombe aragishimira arababwira ati mwende iki musangirire ndababwira yuko uhereye none tazanywa ku mbuto zimizabibu ukagezaho ubwami bw'Imana buzazira yenda umutsima arawushimira Arawumanya gura, araba arawubaha. Arababwira ati uyu ni umubiri wanje ubatangiwe. Muje mukorera mutya kugira ngo munyibuke. Ni gikombe akigenza atyo bamaze kurya ati iki gikombe ni sezerano risha ryo mu maraso yanje ava kubwanyu. Amen. Amen. Iri ni jambo ry'Imana. This is the word of the Lord. The Bible tells us, let us not forget. Let us not forget the death of Christ. Let us not forget the blood that he shed for us. Let us not forget the blood that he shed for us. Make us remember where we came from, where we are, Ye, and where we're going. Yes, we end up with Jacumusaraba Gufira Banyabjaha. When Jesus was about to die on the cross for the sinners, Ahamagarabi Gishwabiwe, he called his disciples, Yifuza Kukova Sangira, and you longed that they may eat together. Araba Gurangoni Fuja Kuko to Sangira, and he said, I long that we may share. Kuko Mutazong and Akumbo Nanichara and Namu Kugango Tongere to Sangira. For you will not see me again seated with you so that we. That's where we've just prayed. That he got bread. He got bread in his hands. And then he broke the bread. And he said, my body is going to be broken for your sake. The disciples saw how he was breaking the bread. And then after that he got the cup. And he got the wine and said, this is symbolic of my blood. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. And then he said, this is symbolic of my blood. Gufa kwa Yesu, no kuzuka kwa Yesu, kugirango tumenya gachiro, ko gufa no kuzuka kwa Yesu. We are now remembering the death and resurrection of our Lord Jesus Christ, so that we may know the value of that kind of process. Then he gave thanks to the Lord. And after that, he shared it with the disciples. He shared it with the disciples. 
I want us to remember again how Jesus died on the cross. I want us to remember again the blood of value that was shed for me and you. That gives us great value and honor in the journey towards heaven. Without delay because that's what we are going to talk about. Pastor Stani Ashime Kukumubiri wa Kristo Afashe Uriya Mugateba Amanya Guwe Kukumubiri wa Amanya Guwe Awushimire I'm going to request Pastor Stani To uh, lift the bread And then give thanks Nanone Tulata kusaba Pastor Jean Paul Nawe Aze kufata Iliya Nkongoro Nanone Aishimire Ikimenye Tocha Maraso Ya Yesu Kubgatu and we're going to request Pastor Jean Paul to lift up the, the cup, symbolic of the blood of Jesus, and then give thanks. Kandi to our Gidia, Kandi to Ash, who sing in a Masezran, Rakoze, Mami Esu Christ. To Rakwing in the Hugirango, Uyumuri Mokoze, Nuzigiri, we fagus a Kuzimaga to Quez, Ugirango Duhore, to Zirikana, Kandi Duhore, to gain the Ramuquera Qua. Ugeze gihe imani zavugira tukaza gusanga mu bwami bwawe urakoze cyane tugushima ni mwizi najya wagera Yesu Kristo amen barakoze rero kandi saba barinjye batufashe mu ndirimbo kugira ngo abashumba na bandi bakoze ibimana badufashe kwegera uruhimbi baririmbe kwaya to give us a song as the pastors and other people help us to do Holy Communion. Yeah. 
We thank you for your blood. Amaraso ya duhindu ya bana b'Imana. Blood that changed us to be sons of God. Amaraso satani atareba ho numunsi numwe. The blood that the devil cannot access. Turagushimiye kuko ayo maraso ya dukijije umuvumo wose. We thank you for the blood. Turagushimiye kuko ayo maraso ya dukijije indwara zose. For the blood healed us of every disease. Icyuba iro ni cyawe iteka ryose mwana w'Imana. The blood and honor yours forever. Ayo maraso ya duje ni mana rurema. The blood that made us success with God. Yes, thank you, Jesus. We love for you, Jesus. For the wonderful work you did for the world. The glory and honor you. Let us stand as we 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 we
Ukoreshe mu mwanya wo kurama imana Kumbi mirimo imana yakozi duhereza Yesu ngumucunguzi wacu What the Lord did for us giving Jesus our savior yes. Karibu abaririmbye Let's go into the word of the Lord. Let's go into the word of the Lord. Welcome to the world. This is a special day. The day the Lord wants to revive your physical and spiritual life. 
Mwaka. Many people are celebrating Pascha. We are celebrating and seeing that Jesus is resurrected from the dead. We would not have we have no power of the message if Jesus had not resurrected from the dead. We welcome you to the word of the Lord. And we wish that you go by the power of the resurrection of Jesus Christ. Praise the Lord. We're not going to recap all that we studied throughout the week. We are talking about the power of the cross of Jesus. We are talking about the power of the cross of Jesus. We are talking about the power of the cross of Jesus. The person who led us during the Wednesday fellowship told us that when the Christian reached at the cross, they were counted by three men. When you meet the cross, your life transforms. Your life it looks like that of God. When that Christian met that time of the cross, his burdens at the cross, we are talking about the power of the cross. But tonight we are talking about resurrection of Jesus. In few minutes about on the thing that we talked about. The power of the cross. When you meet the cross. Number one, all your sins are erased. When a Christian met the cross, the first man he met said, Your sins have been forgiven. And the burden that was upon his shoulders fell on the feet. At the cross, your sins sins are erased and you have uncommon power. You don't carry the burdens other people carry when you meet the cross. The second man that met the Christian he took away the filthy rags. Upon meeting the cross, the Lord takes away your filthy rugs and you get special kind of power. The power of the cross changes your life and God puts his glory upon you. And the second man put a mark upon that Christian. And he got the scroll and gave it to him. At the cross, the Lord gives you the mark of the seal of the Holy Spirit. And with that mark of the Holy Spirit, you overcome all kinds of battles. And he gave him the scroll of the book. And say, don't forget to always read this scroll. When you are resurrected with Christ, the word of the Lord always dwells within your heart. We try to explain to you in briefly what Passover means. What Passover means. If a person asks you, what is the Passover? We talked about it on Thursday and Friday. The Bible scholars talk about it in different ways. And they talked about it as 
being a way of transference. It is a way of transfer when God transfers you from darkness, from calamity into the kingdom of his love. It means being transferred from death to eternal life. It reminds us of where we were taken from to where we are and where we shall be for eternity. Jesus brought joy to us. People that have, don't have the joy for the word of the Lord. You don't have that Passover. Umusi, Baba Gore, Bag and Anayesu, Bagerano Kumbaye. The day when those women who were walking with Jesus came to the tomb, to his tomb. Ngova San Zeba Baza Ninkuru, Baba Giraku Koyesu, Yazutari Kobataza Huari. They told them that Jesus is resurrected, but they never knew where he was. Ngova Sanga Bagenziba, Bokoba, Rabari Mumaju, Mumaju. They found their own were crying in pain. Ngobahayebi bazangwese uyu Yesu ko yazutse ko tutabonye eh ko tutamubonye twagera no mu gituro tugasanga harimo imyambaro yiwe ari he ngo abasanga numubabaro cyane bamere baremererewe. They were in great pain for they did not see him even when they found his cloth in the tomb. Despite the circumstances you go through, if Jesus is within you, you are always joyful. When, when Jesus is not resurrected within you, when Jesus is not resurrected in you, you are always under pity, you are always anxious and worried. That is the Passover. We talked about many things about the power of the cross. When you meet the cross, you start walking as a child of God. What marks you as the child of the Lord is the power of the Holy Spirit that ever dwells within you. You sing in times you are not supposed to sing because of the power of God that dwells within you. Shall we clap for the Lord? We talked about the power of the cross that Jesus atoned forever for the sins of the people that are in the world. On, on the cross, Jesus said, all is finished, all is finished. I want to tell you that everything was finished, every burden that you have on the cross. Is it it was it was finished. Finished. Another set of power we talked about on the cross. Jesus, Jesus through the cross brought love as we say that for God so loved the world and he gave his only son that whoever believes in him shall not perish. On the cross you have love, you even love the people that hate you. 
mbaga zo kumusaraba uri muri wowe hari zindi mbaga zigukoresha ugakora iby'abandi batakora kubera imbaraga z'urukundo ziri muri wowe because of the power of love you got through the cross you do things that are special Receive the power of the cross. Receive the power to forgive. Receive the power of love. Receive the power to tramp over the devil and demons. Another set of power we talked about. When you meet the power of the cross, you don't fear. You don't move under fear. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Bible says we have not inherited the spirit of fear. But the spirit of power. And that power that is that we are children of God. I pray that you move under that power, the power of the cross. The power of the cross protects you from death. The power of the cross protects you from death. The power of the cross protects you from death. It was Elisha that they, that they, they, they came against and the power of darkness came against them. There are people that you can fight against. There are people that you don't dare to fight against. They knew that they would arrest him and do whatever they wanted. But Elisha knew the power of the cross. When the servant came and told Elisha that all is war against us, and Elisha said, I pray that your eyes may open so that you may know the power of the cross that works through us. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Receive the power above all power. Receive the power above all I pray that the Lord will engulf you with the power that is so special above any other kind of power. Let us read the word for today. Perhaps you left the scroll of your book. The Christian lost it. You read that book, the pilgrim's book. What will confirm to you that you have that power? You always long to read the word of the Lord. Because that's where we pick that power of the cross. Hallelujah. Let us clap for our God. The power of the cross. On Wednesday, the pastor that preached to us said, let us seek the power of God. Let us seek the power of the Lord for it is present. When you lose as a Christian the power of God, when a Christian loses the power of God, it is as if you are not yet you are. You are like the walking dead, a person. Who 
Imana ngo wumve icyimana ivuganye nawe when you don't have the power of god that attracts you to the word of the lord so that you may know what the lord is speaking to you niha handi satana azaka kugaragura uko yishaki the devil will always attack you and conquer you the way he wants imbaraga zo kumusaraba nizo twaganiriye the power of the cross is what we talked about reka dusome ijambo ry'imana mu gitabo cha cha marco Let's go to the word of the Lord the book of Mark Marco nibice 16 chapter 16 murongo waho wa gatandatu and verse 6 arababwira ati mwitangara nzi yuko mushaka Yesu w'i Nazareti wabambwe ariko yazutse ntari hano doraho bari bamushyize ni mugende mubwira abigishwa be na Petero muti arababanziriza kujya igariraya iyo niho muzamubonera nkuko yababwiye wasomye umurongo wa kangahe wa gatandatu eh etangira kwa gatandatu ndi arababwira arababwira ati mwitangara nzi yuko mushaka Yesu w'i Nazareti wabambwe ariko yazutse ntari hano doraho bari baramushyize ni mugende umbwira bigishwa be na Petero muti arababanziriza kujya igariraya iyo niho muzamubonera nkuko yababwiye urakoze cyane thank you so much dusomere mu gifaransa ufite igifaransa nkunda person in french please read for us nundi aze gusoma mu cyongereza and also in english somebody will dashimira pastor ivona yatuboye neza kugira ngo tugire umwanya wo kumva ijambo ry'Imana no gutaha thank you pastor ivona for leading us well and give us enough time dusomere mu gifaransa il leur dit ne vous prévente pas vous cherchez jesus de nazareth qui a été crucifié il 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 est ressuscité il n'est point ici voici le lieu où l'avait mis mais allez dire à ses disciples et à Pierre qu'il vous précède à Galilée c'est là que vous le verrez urakoze cyane cyakwa nasome nawe mu cyongereza do not be alarmed he told them you are looking for do not be alarmed neye pape he told them you are looking for Jesus of Nazareth who was crucified he has risen He is not here see the place where they put him. Urakoze cyane. Reka twakire ijambo ry'Imana turi komera amashe. Let's welcome the word of the Lord by clapping our hands. Ngira ngo twasomye Bibiliya wasigarana agenda cyangwa aho wandika ariko gusoma tukureke. Keep your notebook and stop reading. Bibiliya iratubwira ngo isabato ishize. The Bible says that Oh, after the sabbath maria na magdalena mary magdalene nanyina wa yakobo and the mother of james ngo bagura ibihumura neza they bought spices bashaka mavuta meza cyane they got spices good spices bumva gabaja gusiga umubiri wa yesu and perfume to go and perfume the body of jesus batangazwa nuko bashitse basanga imva ya Yesu rarangaye they were alarmed to find that the tomb of Jesus was open imva ya Yesu yari irangaye the tomb of Jesus was open singenda mu makuru ko byagenze kose mwasomye bibiliya kandi murayumva cyane i am not going into details hari ku tumweru niko bibiliya itubwira it was on a sunday as per the bible wari wo munsi wa mbere bagera kumva that was the first day they had approached the tomb. and it was early in the morning bari bazanya bati niki cyabaye and they asked themselves what has happened ubwo bari bibaza ngo se ninde uri budukurireho cyagitare kiri kumva ya Yesu kugira ngo turebe Yesu 
asking themselves who is going to take away the rock so they may access the tomb and see Jesus. They were but women without a man. Because that rock that was on the tomb of Jesus. It had many tones. It was so heavy. Asking themselves, you're going to take away this rock so that we may access the tomb and perfume the body of Jesus. These women had the love for Jesus. They had walked with Jesus. Ladies, clap unto our God. That's why we have many women who come for our services. On Wednesday, it was only men that attended the prayer session. Women were many. Sometimes you find in other places very few men and many women. Perhaps because they are the ones who gave birth to Jesus. They were asking themselves how they are going to enter against that rock so that they may access the body of God. There was a reason why these women walked with Jesus up to the time of the tomb. There was Mary that was delivered of seven demons. When you walk with Jesus all your life, even in death, you don't let go of him. If you don't know the love of the Lord, it is easy. But these women went up to the tomb. And they said, We have to take perfumes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When we worship God, when we serve God, when we serve our own, people, when we give our offerings, when we visit the sick. Those are perfumes that go as an aroma. Whatever work of love you do is an aroma before the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do not be alarmed. I want to tell you this morning, do not fear. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do not be alarmed of yes, what are you are in the people. Jesus is resurrected yes, in your life. Life. He was not taken yes, by death. He has taken yes, away the fear. He is your Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. There is another version of French that talks about it differently. Jesus announced them like that. And Jesus after resurrected said, do not fear. Death could not hold me captive. I had a promise of my father in heaven to resurrect. I had to finish the works of the cross. I had to die and go the tomb And I opened the tombs of the righteous so that they may know the power of the cross that Jesus is in the tomb. The Bible says he descended into the heads and set the captive captive. 
That is the power that brought Jesus. And they made him to resurrect from the day. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus is resurrected from the dead. Do not fear. Do not be alarmed. Asking yourself how shall it be? If Jesus is in you, shall be? Jesus will open all the doors of blessing. When people are crying, you'll be laughing because Jesus is resurrected. Jesus said, I've overcome the world. He announced to them and said, I've overcome the world. And he said, go and preach and say, I have overcome the world. Nothing else brought Jesus. He came to take away the sins of the world. He is the one that carries the burden of sin. And saying, please take comfort for his burden on your behalf. The, the verse we've just read in and, in and he said do not be alarmed you are looking for Jesus of Nazareth the one that was crucified he has risen he is not here in the 